I'm Trisha. I'm a fashion and beauty blogger. I own an online boutique at vgystore.com. I also have a physical store located at the quaint and lovely Haji Lane. I'm sure you can tell I have an obvious passion for clothes. One thing I enjoy posting on my blog and especially Instagram is my personal style and outfit of the day post. I would describe my style as girly and feminine. I love to wear pieces made from floaty fabrics such as chiffon and silk in romantic colour palettes. Mm, think pastels or floral prints. Above all, I think one of the most sensual colours a woman can wear is white. It is one of my favourite colours to wear and it looks wonderful with natural, nude makeup and a hint of lip colour. On days when you're feeling romantic, choose fabrics with crochet and lace details to give your outfit a whimsical touch. If I'm dressing up for an evening event, I like to stack up even more delicate bangles and rings and put on a pair of nude or wet shoes. Now that I've chosen my outfit, immaculate hair and makeup is a must for me before I leave the house every day. For a feminine look, I use a thong to curl my hair and create glamorous looking curls. This keeps the look simple and soft, just like my outfits. Then I use a touch of hairspray to keep the curls in place. One of my makeup essentials is a good foundation. I usually keep two in my makeup bag to alternate between a matte or dewy look depending on the occasion. For the rest of my face, I use a blusher with dual tones plus a bronzer to contour and shape the face. Applying a highlighter to your cheekbones is also a great way to give your skin a healthy looking glow. For the eyes, I love the cat eye look. This is done by using a liquid eyeliner to flick the line out from the edge of the eyes. Remember to choose eyeshadow colours that blend well with your final look. Personally, I'm drawn to soft, mysterious colours such as the blues or greens. Lastly, I always like to finish off my makeup with a slick of lipstick. For fragrances, I'm always drawn to floral scents with a slight edge, which is why I'm so in love with the Gucci Flora Garden fragrance line. You can choose from gorgeous gardenia, gracious tuberose, glamorous magnolia, generous violet, and glorious mandarin. So do you like my floral look? Now on to May to share her edgy dress sense. Hi, I'm May. I'm a fashion, lifestyle and beauty blogger at MaxMay.com and I also run 6x6, an online and offline retailer. I've always been fond of fashion, and especially when my family is in the fashion industry, it makes my love for fashion even stronger and even more refreshing. And I love to share all my outfits and beauty looks on my social media platforms. I prefer electric and edgy styles when it comes to my fashion sense. I love layering, and yes, even in Singapore's heat, it can be done with the right pieces. I actually incorporate a lot of leather pieces and colour blocking into my everyday style. I usually choose one leather statement piece, for example, a leather skirt, trousers or shorts and balance the look with a casual sweater or plain t-shirt in neutral colours with a pair of casual heels. If you want to experiment with wearing leather, I think it's a good idea to find something that isn't too tight fitting but schemes the body like a pair of straight cut trousers or like a flare skirt. If you want to try out a leather jacket, it's a good idea to wear it around the shoulders. Not only does this mean you stay cooler, but it means it's easier to whip off when you're running in and out of the aircon. For accessories, I'm really into statement pieces. It can be like a chunky necklace or a leather cap. And yes, you can use leather accessories apart from your handbag. Shoes with interesting details such as studs or prints can really give an otherwise neutral outfit the edge it needs to make it stand out. For my typical beauty look, I apply a neutral base such as foundation followed by an eyeliner or a smoky eye depending on which event I'm heading to. I also can't live without my contact lenses. They can add some drama to my eyes and it always lights it up. Overall, I prefer soft makeup so it doesn't clash with my bold outfit choices. For evenings, however, I do like to add a dash of red or maroon lip colour. I think it can instantly dress up your face and I keep my hair quite simple, either straight and sleek or with the soft waves that frame the face. Just like my style, I like fragrance to be a bit edgy as well. The limited edition Gucci Stats fragrance is the perfect embodiment of this. I was first attracted to the bottle with its gold studded exterior. It looks so good 
you could almost carry it around as an accessory. The Gucci Starch fragrance makes me stand out from the crowd with a spicy, unique edge. It's not for the faint-hearted, that's for sure. And in fact, it's so intense that the notes linger on my skin even after an entire night of party. So what do you think? Floral or edgy for you? We hope you like the video and have fun dressing up. Don't forget to check out Closet for more fashion and beauty inspirations. Bye-bye!